Um, okay, OBS just kind of glitched out a little bit there. And Windows updated, and no matter what, it keeps telling me that I need to update again when I restart, so that's fun. Maybe it's just a coincidence, or maybe there's something wrong with the computer. Maybe it's haunted, the haunted computer. Do, 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 do. All right, that's done. Uh, okay, let's get my links out. Surprise stream. Yeah, we're starting early today. Uh, Leo's still asleep. We're risking it. Uh, poor kid's really tired. So I think he'll um, he'll stay asleep for a while. Or, eh, I don't know. We'll see. It's already noisy here anyway because of, of the storm. Uh, I don't know if you guys will be able to hear it. Uh, Audacity is usually a lot more sensitive than OBS for some reason. But, um... It's settled a bit anyway. And hey, you can just hear the storm in the game right now. There'll be background noise here. That'll mask it a little bit. In the Catherine VOD, you said that you hate reaction channels. How can you say that when your job is to stream video games and react to them? I don't think streaming is my job. Um, I don't like reaction channels that will go and look at other YouTube videos and just watch them and and just record the reactions and then that's just the whole thing. Um, or reacting to trailers as well. I don't know. It seems kind of lame. Playing a game is always going to be more active and you're interacting with your audience at the same time. Live streaming a reaction? Hmm, that might be different. That's probably different. I kind of did that with Catherine at the end, right? With the YouTube video. That's probably different. Depends on how involved it is. After FTL and Into the Breach, have you warmed up to turn-based combat a bit? Or do you still think that real-time is always better? Mm, well, I don't think I, I ever... Did I ever say that real time is always better, always, always? Because uh, I played chess a lot when I was a teenager, uh, and I think chess is fantastic, and there's something very pure and elegant about chess, and chess is turn-based. So I I've always known it can work in some cases, but uh, in general, I would still maintain that real time is better, but that's in general, not in every case. Uh, FTL was a lot better than I thought, but I was playing on stream, so I might have been enjoying it more because it was on stream. I wish I'd played it before. It was always something I wanted to check out. Uh, Into the Breach is fantastic, though, even off stream. I would have enjoyed that. that. That feels like single player chess to me. It's really, really good. It brought me back to uh, chess tournaments that I was in, and uh, that kind of line of thought. Where you're looking at something, you're like, okay, if I do this, this is gonna happen. Then I do this, then I do that, then I do this, then I do that, and it's, uh, yeah, it was really cool. It was a lot of fun. I think your exact words were, "There's no turn-based RPG that couldn't be improved with a good action RPG system." Paraphrasing. Mm, yeah, I think I would. I think I would stick with that. Yeah. Yep. Turn-based RPGs, I don't think there's there's a good turn-based RPG system that I've seen. Um, 
like FTL is not turn-based in the same way that turn-based RPGs are, and neither is Into the Breach. Uh, I think whenever I've spoken about that in the past, I have maintained that uh, if there is a field that you have to manage and you are moving your, your units around, that that could add a whole other layer to it that most turn-based RPGs don't have. Uh, even though I don't like XCOM, um, I, I will recognize that XCOM has a lot more going for it than Final Fantasy 2. You know? Excited for Devil May Cry 5? Not really. Uh, I'm not dreading it or anything. It's it's not like, oh shit, that game's coming out, fuck that. No, I'm just, just not really excited for it. Uh, I've lost my passion for that series. Uh, I think it died around the second game. It was that early. The first game was fucking magical. It was a big deal. I played it at release and I loved it. Um, and then the second one came out, and it was trash, and then the third one came out, and the third one was good, but it was a prequel, and I don't like prequels, uh, even back then I didn't like prequels, and I felt like it embraced the wackiness a little too much, so even though I enjoyed the gameplay a lot of Devil May Cry 3, I think the one-two punch of two into three kind of killed it for me. Four was a bit disappointing in some ways, uh, I did enjoy four, but, uh, it recycled a little bit too much, so... The series has been disappointing as it's gone on, I think. I don't know. How am I? Why so early? Uh, we're early because I've been awake since 11 p.m. last night. And uh, I want to not miss a stream, but also get some sleep. So we're starting early. And then we will... Then, you know, when we're done, I'll go have a, some sleep. And then hopefully there won't be any big wind tonight. And I can finish recording the second 76 video. Are you going to review Sekiro and or stream it? Sekiro, Sekiro. Um, a video on it is almost guaranteed, but it won't be for a while because Souls like games. I know a lot of people disagree. It's not going to be like Souls. I, I, I've, from what little I've seen in the gameplay, it looks very much like Souls to me. Uh, from the minute to minute combat. Uh, but I'll, I will be happily proven wrong if that's not the case. But um, those games take a lot of time even for a short video. So that'll be after The Witcher, if it happens, and it almost certainly will. Um, streaming it? I said before, if I'm going to stream it, it'll be a second playthrough. I'll play that one by myself. Those games are special to me, so I want to play by myself. Wait, you're doing another 76 fit? Yeah, it was always planned to be two. I mentioned that in the first video. There's there's always two. This one is a commentary of um, of all the, the, the bugs that I ran into while I was playing. Uh, so, originally, uh, I collected all the bugs and glitches that I had on my list and that I found when I went through all my footage, and it was five hours long, and then I trimmed it down to three and a half hours, I believe, and right now I've got it down to what I think is going to be the final cut, because I just need to put the audio to it and tweak it a little bit, which is about two and a half hours. Uh, I, I could have, I probably could have made like a 15 hour video and just rambled for 15 hours over example after example after example but uh that would be bad so uh i didn't go overkill on most of them some of them i did but not not all of them just so you know you will very likely be finishing this run of re2 likely halfway into a normal stream for you to let you know that you likely have to start something else unless you want to end early or you take your time oh, okay um well maybe we'll um maybe we'll start a clear run or see how it goes after we're done i didn't know the second video would have a voiceover yeah it does yep yeah. it has um i just improvised the whole thing uh, i have one one last section to record and uh, then I'll just put it to the video that I already have matched up. Um, it's, it's already there. I wonder if I can show you guys that. No, I can't. I can't show you guys that because uh, Adobe Premiere um, uses, uh, uses the GPU now. And it won't let me have Adobe Premiere open at the same time that OBS is, is open or that OBS is recording. Maybe I took a screenshot of it. Hold on, let me see. A 
I wish I could eat, could be eating my breakfast. My campus had a power loss for about two hours. That sucks. That sucks, that sucks. Sorry for you. Okay, so I have um I have old pictures. I can put them those on the screen. Let's see. Okay. So this is the glitch catalog as it looks like in Adobe Premiere right now. So I'll make it as big as I can. All right. So Quest broken, combat glitch, um, lag issues, weird glitch, visual glitch, critique specific, uh, bugged rooms lighting, and then there's all the bugs I encountered while I was with Mandalore. Um, so this was the raw amount of bugs, which was about four and a half hours at this point when I was doing the critique. And if I switch this over to a closer one, uh, these are all the combat glitches. So every single time that you see a line between these blue rectangles, that's a new scene. That's a new clip. Uh, so these are all the combat glitches that I encountered that I consider to be uh, in combat. Now, two of these are very long clips here. Uh, the one on the left and the one on the right. Uh, those got trimmed down significantly. Uh, so basically what I've been doing is I went through all of them and I I willed it down from combat glitches to specifically um, enemies not reacting when you shoot at them, enemies t dealing damage to you when they shouldn't have hit you, um, enemies warping around, uh, enemies having the wrong weapon equipped and the visual, that sort of thing. And I just made categories like that um, from all of the bigger categories until I think I had about 40 categories and then I've just been speaking over the clips that I arranged in a way that flows together well. At least I think so. Uh, so yeah, it started off in around five hours. And then I got it down to, I think, I think three and a half. And over the course of putting the audio to them, I've got it down to two and a half hours now. So I, I think that's where it'll settle. If I can get it shorter, I will. Uh, contrary to popular, popular belief, I actually do try to make the videos as short as they possibly can be. Um, but I won't sacrifice what I consider to be important points. And I also won't sacrifice too much of my writing style and my tone. I do know that I'm a little wordy, but, uh, that's how I like to communicate. That's much more effort than I thought it would be. I thought we were just getting a couple of the bear clips back to it. No, no, <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, I did almost all this already for the, for the first video, so. Anyway, uh, let's start playing the game. Uh, but before we do that, I need to say thank you to people. Uh, thank you, Dodekin, Malamber, It Only Takes Zvai, Tiger Dude Boy, Apocalyptic Gymnastics, Blizzkin25, Manbrush, Flare Force87, and Slever for subscribing while the stream was down. Thank you very much. And since the stream started, thank you, Mr. Andrus. For the 513 sub, hi Joe, how are you? I'm doing okay. Uh, I'm kind of pissed that uh, there's been two nights in a row that I wasn't able to record. Um, last night it was uh, the windstorm like I tweeted about. The night before, uh, there was some wind, but it was mostly that for, for whatever reason, it just like, hey, here's a shit ton of planes that are just going to fly over your house at four in the morning. And just like, oh, okay. Um, and that... <laughs> was picked up on the microphone real clear. So it's like, okay, this is done. Um, so I'm pretty pissed about that. But apart from that, I'm okay. I'm going to be, I'm going to start crashing and I'll be tired soon. But for now, I'm all right. Uh, Lord Popple has subscribed for the first time. Welcome to primetime, Lord Popple. Oh no, it's not primetime. I'm sorry. Maybe I'm crashing already. Uh, welcome to Monkey Town, Lord Popple. 
Uh, Eticus has resubscribed for two months. Hey, 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 Eticus. Thank you so much. Uh, Sylvan has resubscribed for eight months with you told me to find a dumb joke for my next sub message. So here goes. Two goldfish are in a tank. One says to the other, do you know how to drive this thing? That's a classic. It's a classic goldfish joke. Thank you, Sylvan. Uh, Madbake has resubscribed for 16 months. Oh, this is the email. I keep forgetting. I'm sorry, Madbake. Uh, Madbake has resubscribed for 16 months with Hell Yeah, I'm Not a VOD Boy, just for right now. Good to see you, Madbake. Hope things are going well. Uh, Lesbian Waifu has resubscribed for two months with Hey Joe, VOD Girl here. It's been two months already that you're my favorite streamer. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, I love watching you while I draw and study, so thanks for the content and know that I'm always looking forward to it. That's, that's a very sweet message, Lesbian Waifu. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Uh, thank you, JCell, for the 15 month resub. 15 months in a row and 15 months total. What a coincidence. Thank you, JCell. Uh, hey, Rezus, or Hey, Rezus, for the 8 month resub. Hi, Joe. Congrats on the girl. I'm planning a trip to Canada from France, working remotely for June and July. Do you have any recommendations on places to visit? Well, first of all, thank you for, for the congrats. Uh, in case you missed it, uh, Lily is pregnant and has been pregnant for a while. Uh, and we found out a couple days ago that we're having a girl. So we have two boys already and we're having our first girl. Uh, but the ultrasounds can be wrong. Uh, but yeah, they're, I think it's like 80% accurate. 80 to 90 percent uh so yeah we're having our first girl so we're very excited it's a it's a whole new thing uh do i have any recommendations to visit in canada um not really because i haven't been around canada much as an adult uh when I was a kid, uh, we went from Toronto to Calgary, and we stopped on some places along the way, and now I've gone east to Moncton from Toronto, um, but mostly I've just kept in Toronto, so uh, go visit Toronto. Toronto's pretty good. Uh, June, July, it's going to start getting hot in July, so uh, be aware of that, but it's probably a pretty good time to visit. Uh, apart from that, I, I can't help you, sorry. I really can't. I really can't. I have heard that downtown Toronto has um, some of the best food in North America in terms of like quality and variety, but I never got to experience that. So if you like to go and go to restaurants and stuff, you might want to check that out. And the CN Tower is always fun. Uh, Ingvar Fed has resubscribed for 14 months. Thank you very much, Ingvar Fed. Mabek has used some bits to say still waiting for the... Oh, yeah, yeah, I, I said it when I saw your resub. Yeah, sorry, Mabek. That was before your bits already coming at that point. Uh, three peas or three pies has resubscribed for 14 months. How does it feel to know your daughter will one day be someone's waifu? Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't you have to be anime to be a waifu? Oh, is that, is that what you're insinuating? My daughter is going to be... Uh, sorry, it's weird saying my daughter. Well... Uh, my daughter's anime. Wow. I resemble that remark. Uh, Hulk and Twitch has resubscribed for two months. Hey, Joe, can you please read your Christmas poem out loud? Love your videos. I do in the video. Uh, in the video that's coming out as soon as I get the next recording session done. Um, there's a part in the video where uh, I let all my crashes play. Uh, the ones that showed up on the footage, at least. And uh, I have nothing to say about those crashes, so I just I'd read the poem in the video. So, uh, if you want want it there, there you go. Spoilers, yeah, I know, I know. Uh, thank you, Red Hippie Storm, for the 16-month resub. Never too late to tell a dad joke. Do you know why they're called dad jokes? Because dad rhymes with bad. Uh, Dragon555 has, has subscribed with Prime. I've said your name plenty of times, Dragon555, but welcome to Prime Time. Thank you, thank you. Welcome, welcome. Cranky Geek has subscribed with Prime for the first time as well. Welcome to Prime Time, Cranky Geek. Qwerty U I O P A S F G H J K Z Z has resubscribed for 12 months. Welcome to the One Year Club, Qwerty. Damn, I've already been sub for a year, and even I don't know how to pronounce my username yet. <laughs> Hey, we're about to um, we're about to get to the one year anniversary of the Persona Five streams, right? That's the thing that's about to happen. The twelfth is Leo's birthday, and the fourteenth is when we started playing uh, Persona Five. 
It's his second birthday though. We we didn't start two years two days after he was born. Okay, let's put some concept art on the screen. Uh, thank you, Square Cranberry, for the 16 month resub. 16 months. Love you, Joe. Thanks for the content as always and keeping the cringe strong. Thank you, Square Cranberry. Thank you, thank you. You're stuck in the cringe cafe. Uh, thank you, Kimmy Chi, for the 16 month resub as well. Hey, Joe, missed some of the Resident Evil. What are your quick thoughts about it? Mostly positive, but not strongly positive. So um, I'm having a good time, not a great time. Uh, the combat. And that part of the gameplay is a little disappointing for me. Uh, I'd like to play it again on normal and see if I would have enjoyed normal better. The saving ink ribbons thing and the amount of damage that I can take doesn't really bother me. In fact, that might be a, a, a positive. Uh, but the sheer amount of bullets it takes to kill anything in this game is kind of bringing it down a bit. So maybe it'd be better on standard. Maybe it's more balanced there. But I don't know. We'll see. Maybe just this gameplay is just flawed for me. I don't know. But I like the level design, and I like the how you navigate it all. Uh, there's something kind of um, really solid about the Resident Evil games and how you you move around the worlds. There's something really yeah, I don't know, yeah, solid is the best word for it. But it's not, it's still not good. I have to think about it more and, and really figure out why I think that way. There's something really satisfying about how it all fits together. Fallon has resubscribed for 16 months with the message, hey, hey, welcome to, <laughs> welcome to Denny's. <laughs> Sorry, have you seen, have you seen the, the, it's a, they're vines, right? They're, they're gone now where the guy's like, hey, welcome to Chili's. <laughs> I don't know why, but that made me think of that. Thank you, Fallon. Um, Divorce Six Times has resubscribed for eight months. Thank you very much, Divorce Six Times. Always good to see your name. It's high welcome to Chili's. Um, thank you, Divorce Six Times. Uh, Dragon555 is using her business to say, it didn't let me send a sub message, but I wanted to congratulate you on the girl. Oh, thank you very much, Dragon555. Thank you very much. Uh, Senrahan has resubscribed for 15 months with a pickle email keeping the pickles alive. And I have one, two, three, four more left on my list here. Is the pickle really gonna survive one of the powders? Has, has the pickle gang, are they rising up a little bit? Thank you again, Senrahan. Uh, Coach Ruin has resubscribed for eight months with, hey Joe, just stopping by to say you're great. Hope you're enjoying Resident Evil 2. Yep, I'm enjoying it. Yep, not loving it, but I'm enjoying it. Yep, I'm having a good time. I'm, I'm happy that I played it again. Thank you very much for the resub, Coach Ruin. Mr. Silverstrike has subbed for the first time with Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Mr. Silverstrike. Welcome to Monkey Town, as Finn would say. Orelka13 has resubscribed for 14 months with Hijo. What was the game you most enjoyed playing on stream? My bets on Persona 5, as usual. Welcome back to Twitch. Um, it's between Zombie Chronicles 2, Persona 5, Undertale, uh, and Dang the Danganronpa games. Reseteer was a lot of fun too, but I, I can firmly say that Persona 5 is above that. Uh, I'm going to say it's probably between Danganronpa and Persona 5. I had a lot of fun streaming those games, and streaming definitely made it more fun. Persona 5 is probably going to win though, I think. I'd have to think about it, but yeah, it's between those two. Maybe there's like one short one-off stream that I'm forgetting about. Hmm. Yeah, the Persona Pals. I'm looking forward to playing Persona, the Persona 5 again. Just, I'm concerned, after uh, Atlas released some some bullshit about uh, Catherine Full Body today, I'm concerned that Persona 5 might get the same treatment, that you're not allowed to stream Persona 5 R. We'll see. Maybe it'll be a little while after release that we that we stream it, which is less than ideal. Uh, thank you, Senris, for the 60-month resub with a Kappa message. Rebecca A. Senris. Kappa Kappa. I like Kappa. I wonder if Kappa will survive in culture long into the future. F seems to have a lot of uh, resilience. People say F. 
genuinely, unironically now. And last but not least, Combustlemon. Combust Lemon uh, has resubscribed for five months with with Persona 5 one year anniversary coming around. When will you play the best Persona game? Persona 4. Oh, damn. It's weird that that I said 4 when you said Persona 3 in your message. Um, not sure. Uh, one day. One day for sure. But we already have a list of games we have to get through. I think we have like four or five games that I promise that we'll play. So we have to get through those first. And then we will consider playing Persona 3 and Persona 4. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for the message. Uh, oh, and thank you, Smitty, for resubscribing right now for 15 months with another Kappa. Kappa coming at you. Thank you, Smitty. You. Thank you. Thank you. So let's start the stream off with a fun uh, Finn story that I've been looking forward to saying all day. It's very short. So when Finn wants something... Finn says that he gets it. So he's pointing at things and he's saying, Finn gets. But it doesn't sound like that. <laughs> it sounds like he's saying something else. <laughs> and uh, Lily and I have to like, just kind of like bite our tongue as, uh, as he's saying it. <laughs> All right, where are we going? Uh, cafeteria. And if you don't understand what we're saying, uh, say Finn gets very quickly to yourself right now and just hope that there's no one else around uh, as you're doing it. What happened to these boxes over here? Oh, how do we play this game again? Okay, that sounds like there's more than one zombie in there. Okay, that looked like it missed. How does it feel to be raising a gamer? Pretty good. Yeah, there's more than one in here. Is he coming over? Let's look through the window. Oh, there he is, okay. Oh yeah, fire doesn't stop him, does it? What? How do you get behind me? That was weird. Oh, this coffee is going to be really well done. Another zombie? I didn't think they did that. Shit. Eh, let's just use all the ammo we have. We've already started. Oh. Oh, it died. Cool. Alright. Uh. 
Okay, what's over here? Huh, is that is that in the kitchen? No, that's here, what is that? God, I wish we hadn't taken a hit. I'm upset that we took a hit. Oh, flamethrower fuel, nice. Good thing it didn't explode. All right, so are these rooms connected and that's why it's saying that's red? Something in the hall that we missed too? Umbrella cafeteria, nice. Joe, have you played Offworld Trading Company? No, I haven't. It looks interesting, though. I'd like to play it at some point. It's an economic uh, RTS, right? Uh, the game like that I'm looking forward to playing the most right now is the new Anno game. I really like the Anno games. Damn, look at those pancakes. I'm not really big on pancakes. Okay, so I'm gonna bust out one of these freezers. Oh wow, this was just its own combined area, hallway, cafeteria, and kitchen. That's kind of crap. Okay, let's go have a nap. Okay, do I have to kill you? Nah. Wish we had kept our, uh, wish we had kept the shotgun. Regulator flamethrower. Custom part for the flamethrower restricts liquid fuel and compressed gas usage, making it possible to fire for much longer. Oh, well, goddammit, that would have been good to have. What are these, like, subnautica lockers here? Muff. Oh, no. What? Do we not have a thing that we need? Electronic chip. Heh <laughs> handy. Upgrade chip, general staff. Alright, so we need something else to come back here. Alright. Okay. Dad upon wants to kill you. I've already decided that um, uh, the second run of Persona 5 that we're going to do, uh, that we're going to stick with Ass Eaters, of course. Uh, but in order to distinguish the names of the characters, uh, in the second run, Waffles Dad Upon will be Waffles Rad Upon. Not only because he's rad, but also because it's Persona 5 R. I've decided, but we're going to be Ass Eaters. Okay, so now we can go down there, I think. Dr. Lee, your presence is urgently requested by Chief Cartwright in the East Area. Okay, do we have any heals? We have one ink ribbon, we're not gonna use it. Uh, let's throw the, the flamethrower back in for now. Let's take the shotgun. And let's, uh, should we combine some what if you have two large gunpowders? Is such a thing possible? We have two. Is such a thing possible? Is that is that just too much power for one gunpowder? 40 bo Whoa! Holy shit! Whoa! Wow! That's a whoa! That's a lot of bullets. That's a lot of damage. Holy crap! 
Holy smokes. Is is that more than if you had made a, a large gunpowder with a short with a small gunpowder twice? Hey bro. You can't bite me because you have a gas mask on. So we're good. Special forces recording. Alpha to ghosts. Target moving to the west area must be going to retrieve the G virus, an antiviral agent. This is ghost. Understood. Rendezvous at point W3. Roger. This is Alpha. Arrived at destination. Understood. Stand by for target. This is Alpha. I've got eyes on the target. He's going to open that open the safe. Roger. Awaiting the signal. Got eyes on the G virus. We're going in. Doctor Birkin. You'll come along with us quietly. That's that, so advanced. Uh, thank you, Plasma Laser One, for the new sub with Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Plasma Laser One. Welcome, to Monkey Town. And thank you, S P N K R. Spinker, Spinker, Spanker, for the two month three sub. Any chance of a Persona Four playthrough? Very, very high, very high, very high chance. Not sure when though, but very high chance. Yeah. Uh, those are going to be big events though, and I'd like to have uh, a more consistent stream thing going on when we do those but yeah very high okay so we can't get over here all right so is there something we get or do we activate this thing over here okay i don't think we have level three access right oh they're not broken they're just not active okay i understand now Got to be some first aid to spray down here somewhere. I want P42, but I agree you should play Persona 3 first. I think we will play Persona 3 first. I think we'll go 3 4. Yeah. Well, 1 2 first, then 3. Two ink ribbons, nice. And there's a typewriter. Typewriter. Uh, did we just miss something in that in that room, or are these connected? I've been watching the vods of uh, Resident Evil Two, and you said the dialogue is campy. What do you mean with with that? Um, I don't know what what the agreed upon definition of camp is, but. I would say a mix of characters speaking in very awkward ways, but it also being quite cheesy. So Leon unprompted saying, you know what I've been thinking about? That Umbrella should go to, to jail for this and be brought to justice. Like that's, that's pretty cheesy and pretty campy. Okay, how do I split them? Oh, mouse. Okay, mouse wheel. Alright, so we'll keep all these things. Isn't that just bad writing? Mm, camp is usually done on purpose. So, I don't think it would be count as bad writing. Usually. Sorry if you can hear the wind, by the way. That one wasn't too loud, but still. It made me look at the window. Nope. Oh, yep. Jesus. What 
happened here? I just never really heard camp being used to refer to speech stuff. Haven't you? Uh, I think it's fairly common, but I might be mistaken. I get my terminology work uh, mixed up sometimes. I uh, infamously once said to uh, a group of friends um, <laughs> that uh, they they had bet on the wrong money horse instead of cash cow. <laughs> So, I, I do get things mixed up sometimes. Oh, you look cool. <laughs> look at its face. Why son of a bitch? Why son of a bitch? What have you seen, Leon? Are we poisoned? No. Oh, it's not loaded. Great. Input code one one zero three seven. Ah, oh, error, damn. Uh, these are some weird symbols. Can I turn up the game volume, please? Does anybody else want me to do that? If enough people want me to, I will. Dispensing solution now. Okay, enough people are saying yes. I'll turn it up a little bit. Dispersal cartridge. Okay, I turned up a little bit. Just a little. Thoughts on the game so far? Uh, mostly positive, but I'm not loving it. This this isn't the 10 out of 10, oh my god, game of the year contender that uh, many people are saying it is for me. Uh, I, I believe that they're enjoying it, and this game is very special to some people, and of course that's 100% valid, but for me, it, it is not that. It is just a... Like, I'm having a fun time, but um, it's it's about Resident Evil 7 level for me. Uh, thank you, David on Twitch, for the new sub with Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, David on Twitch. Or Davi Don't Witch, but I think it's David on Twitch. Uh, N7 Krios used uh, 1,050 bits to say, have been loving your streams just as much as I love your YouTube stuff. You truly inspire me. Just as much, wow. Most people usually uh, enjoy one way more than the other. And I think it's mostly the YouTube stuff that they prefer over the streams. Uh, so thank you for saying so. And thank you for the bits, uh, N7 Krios. Thank you so much. I'm just glad that so many people find my goofball humor uh tolerable at least <laughs> oh hey zombie oh maybe you're supposed to shoot the pustules what if we shoot the pustules Okay, seems like pustules kill it. So that was a waste of shotgun ammo. Kind of 
kind of want to reload now for the for the shotgun ammo. See, the, this this is better. This is I, I'm assuming they're dead. This is better than than the other zombies taking a, a gazillion hits because this feels like I have some amount of control over it. Oh, they're coming back. Never mind. I take it back. Fuck it. The whole game's trash. Spoke too soon. <laughs> I'm kidding. It's not trash. Okay, is this the only way out? No, there's a red herb over there. That sounds fair. I respect where you're coming from. As someone, as someone who played the original when it came out and played this, I absolutely love it. It must be really special, and I'm, uh, I'm quite jealous actually, or envious rather, uh, that this remake is done so well. If this had been... Like, I'm imagining this being Chrono Trigger, you know what I mean? If that, that was my big game. That would be pretty cool. What happened over here to this uh, guy from Dark Souls? Have you played Worms Armageddon? Should play it with the people from stream sometime. Uh, I don't think I've played that one, but I have played Worms. Uh, one of the a couple of ones that came out for the PlayStation One. Those games were great. Herbicide Synthesis, Plant Four Three, Herbicide Synthesis. Place an empty cartridge into the solution dispenser. Add the required amount of UMB number twenty one. Uh, P. Oh, what's that symbol again? Shit. Actually, maybe I don't know that. Cool immediately. Plant 43 exhibits astounding growth. If something unfortunate were to occur, it may be hard to control. In the event of an unforeseen incident, manufacture the herbicide using the instructions above in order to minimize damage. It's Epsilon? Okay. Okay, so do we need... Okay, we have two grenades. Oh, I thought for sure he was going to come to life. Okay, and we have the gunpowder over here. And is that it? I guess we have to go somewhere else. Hmm. Let's try using it. Maybe we can use it through the bars if it lets us. No, it won't let us. We have to open the bars. Okay, how do we do that? Hmm. Okay, let's go, let's go through that tunnel that we missed. Oh, there we go. Okay, so... <sighs> kind of... F in the middle, two straight lines. Okay. I think I'll remember that. F in the middle, two straight lines. The two L's. And then F in the middle. In the middle, two straight lines, this one, F in the middle. Okay, so that's opened. Alright, so did I miss a code in here? Huh.
uh, before I get behind, um, thank you, Satsun, for the 10 month resub. Hey, 10 months, that's pretty cool. It is pretty cool. Thank you, Satsun. Thank you very much. It was 10 minutes ago, too. Damn, 10, 10, 10. Uh, thank you, Dashaway22, for the new sub with Prime. I feel like I've said your name before, Dashaway22. But um, maybe not. Thank you very much for the new sub. Welcome to Prime Time. And thank you, Timmy, Timmy, 123125, for the 11 month resub. Oh, shit, 11 months already. Almost one full year of weeb dumb. <laughs> with you feels good man remember when you played the evil within and you were casually talking about leon with chat without any memes good times good times uh we i think we've been pretty good for this one there haven't been too many leon uh leon memes or whatever as we're playing this uh we've been surprisingly well behaved i think research lab east area map nice do you still a lot of time towards writing your books nope i haven't done any creative writing in uh quite some time now Yeah, we're getting so, so, so much pistol ammo. Maybe we shouldn't be using it all. Maybe that's a bad idea. Uh, the YouTube videos take up almost all my time. Maybe we should have combined it with high-grade gunpowder for some shotgun shells. They're okay. Uh. Hmm. Okay, so you can combine stuff when you pick it up, but you can't just put it right into the weapon. No? Okay. I probably want to use that because I'm close to death. So let's just use it. And now I can pick up those uh, those bullets. Okay. Trophy. Okay. Well, we'll be able to take that with us. Can I just discard this now that I know that? Is that all that's for? Guac Institute, Innovation Award, Genetics, Umbrella Corporation. Uh, apparently not. Apparently this is used for something else. Okay. Maybe it's used, you have to keep it until you, uh, you put the code in. Oh boy. All right. Well. Yellow. Murph again. Oh. Wait, wasn't it Muff before? Now it's Murph? What? Okay, we need power back on. Joe seems to think it's a high quality remake, although he doesn't enjoy as much as others. Yep. Um yeah, that's that's pretty pretty bang on, yeah. Oh, where the fuck did you come from? Oh, we're dead. We're so dead. Yeah, we're dead. Wow, did we get did we get through that? 
Oh, damn, nice. Go us. All right, well, I'm pretty pissed that I turned around and missed that liquor coming at me, but we only ate one hit there. Huh. If only I knew that this, this door had op would open, I could have avoided the liquor by just going through the door. Son of a bitch. Uh, now let's leave you. Hey, how's it going, my man? Going pretty well, Annie. How's it going with you? Uh, no, we're good. Oh, I should probably be walking. There might be another liquor around. I left the knife in the liquor. I think it broke. It was a damaged knife. So, if I go over there right now, I might get trapped. Oh, shit, we're trapped. Okay. Uh, if they come up the stairs right now, I could probably kill them with a grenade. Yep, let's do it. Probably a waste of a grenade, actually, but oh well. Really? Real okay, that one hit. Somebody's an out. Everybody's turned vegified. They keep coming back again and again. Burn them all. Burn them until their whole body is black as ash. There's no other way. Oh, okay. Wow, you survived a grenade, dude? Isn't that illegal? Signal, signal modulator. Okay, so is that for fixing the other power things? All right, so use flamethrower on the fire guys. Maybe after you uh, you shoot them, shoot their pustules. All right, we're back at the beginning again. Uh, I kind of want to save it after getting through that liquor bullshit. I actually wasn't bullshit, but you, I think you know what I mean. How am I finding the game? It's okay. Okay, now we have some shotgun hurt, uh, ammo. Let's take a knife. Okay, let's keep the dispersal. Let's put the 10 bullets away. Keep that, keep that, keep that, keep that. Okay, keep the dispersal thing. Okay, let's save it. What difficulty is this? This is hardcore. He says this is on the screen. Okay, was uh, Muff in the other area, or is it in this area too? I feel like Muff was in the other area. Was it Muff over here in the nap room, circuit breaker? Where was the other circuit breaker? It was down, wasn't it? Yeah, circuit breaker. I kind of want to go back. Let's go in the stairwell and see what I missed in the stairwell, though. It might be up here though too. Yeah, I didn't handle this encounter very well. I'm kind of pissed about that. Maybe it's a locker. 
Oh, more handgun ammo. Yeah, that's it done. Um, let's go back down. Okay, and we left the zombie alive down here, if I remember correctly. This one here. Oh, he's dead. Okay, what? Is that not... Is that not correct? Oh, oh shit, how do I... Okay, OSS, MUF, AWF, MRF. It's MRF, right? It's MRF, all right. I didn't even see that, I just went right onto here. All right, MRF. Another combat knife. Watch out, lickers. Oh, what the fuck? Why is it giving me another save thing? Flamethrower fuel and something else, too. I hate inventory management in games. So much. So much I hate it. I think the game would be less without it though. So I don't know what that means. Okay, can we get through there now, the locked door? Yeah, we can. All right, there's gonna be baddies in here. There's no way there's gonna be one, two, three rooms without without some shambling boys. They've got the shambles. Oh, there's one. Let's go get our breaking bat on. For sure. Dead for sure. 
for sure dead. Welcome back, Dr. Lee. You have five new messages. How many hours in is this? Um, I don't know. I think this is stream. Is this the fourth stream? Maybe it's the third stream. I think it's the fourth stream. Okay, so we're going in there for some of the some of the chemicals that we need. Wayne Lee's inbox. Rick Mendoza, what's he up to? Can you believe that bastard Cartwright? Oh yeah, I was just wondering about him. Cool your jets, asshole. Well, I guess he is the boss for now. Anyway, have you seen my helix anywhere? I put the secret on the bottom. Let me know if you find it. Damn. Byron Cartwright, busy guy, huh? Guess you never miss, huh? So you couldn't make our little meeting? Fine, don't worry about the greenhouse inspection. Instead, I'll give you something real simple to do. Put together the budget estimate for the year after next and get it done tonight. <laughs> Sender Rick Mendoza. Subject, are you alive? We're under attack. People are dead. The east area is cut off, but I still put a subject line in the email. We can't operate the bridge without the, with the wristbands we have here. Where is that bastard Cartwright hiding? Rick Mendoza, subject, please reply. Plant 43 is gone wild. The greenhouse is hell. We need to send someone in there before it's too late. Wayne, how do we stop this thing? You have to help us. Please reply. Rick Mendoza, subject, none. Do you, do you remember Susie, the cheerleader? What a great gal. We were both into her. Of course, she wasn't into nerds. I still, gave, I still have to give you back those comics and games I borrowed, but you might, you might have to wait a while. What? All right, that was kind of weird. Ugh. Who left the freezer open? Probably a zombie. Oh, there he is, it's a cool boy. What's with this lion going down here right now? Is that is that intentional? What's that? That's kind of weird. Is there another one of these? Okay, you're you're alive for sure. You guys aren't seeing the line. It might not show up very well on uh, on Twitch. Error. Solution is required to begin. Oh. Well, shit. Some people are seeing it. Okay. All right. Well, the solution might be in this room. I have a feeling it's not. All right. Are you gonna Are you gonna let me pass? Hold on, let, let me let me wipe them all down, and then I'll ask him which one will get us drunk, and then we'll use it, and then I'll dust her fingerprints, and I'll figure it out from there. Works every time. Okay, so I think that we are... Uh, we're not meant to be in here yet. Let's go explore some other areas. Do I have any apple juice now? No apple juice. So we can go back to the top or we can go to the other area. Let's go to the other area. 
What game is he referencing? I'm referencing uh, Shammy and Mandalore's stream of uh, Mystery of the Druids. Wait, am I hearing enemy music? Oh no. Oh yeah, there is. There's a there's a dude there. How'd you get here? The breaking containment. Okay, was there anything in this room? No, just stairs. Okay, or just ladder. Okay, so there's not gonna be a guy waiting for us right at the top, so we should be fine. I've never been more wrong. So, two L's, one line, big square, small square, big line. Two L's, uh, small line, big square, small square, big line. All right, so that's unlocked. So I go in there, I use that, and then I get, and then I go down to the area. Okay, what's in the greenhouse that I missed? I don't think I went over in this area here. All right, I really want the flamethrower. Oh, never mind. I don't want it that bad. Shit. Knife him, knife him. Wow, enemies really don't like knives. Solution to match cartridge capacity. What? Why don't why what? Why don't you just do it for me? <laughs> okay, I don't know what's gonna happen. What happens when I Oh fucking hell. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. Oh no god no. All right, so there we go. Okay, we're gonna be here a while. We're gonna be here a while. Okay, are those two enough? This is this is it, right? This is enough. Is that is that enough for those two? That looks like it to me. Okay, so I need to to transfer the, this both into the other one. So how how the fuck do I do that? I can't do that right now. That's not gonna work. Um, how do I how do I switch these two over? I don't think I can. Uh, hold on, if I do, if I do this, is 
Is this going to fill out completely? It'll be gone. All right, that's a gone. And then I put it over to the empty one. No, that's not going to do it. Shit. No, I messed this up. Oh, wait, did I? Maybe I didn't. I want these two over in one. And then I want one of these over. Um, and then just combine it over to the other one, right? And that's it. This, this should do it, shouldn't it? That's it, right? These two together. It doesn't have to be, it can be any of them. It can be one of the other two. This should be it, right? Okay, I think, I think I made that harder for myself by not realizing I could use either of the other two. I thought I had to specifically use one of the three cylinders. Like, I, I knew I couldn't use this one here because it, it, it stops too short. Uh, but I didn't realize I could use either of the other two. I thought I had to use one of them, but I could use either of the other two. Okay. I can do this. I really want my knife back. Um, thank you to, hold on. I am 999-1000 for the 12-month resub. Welcome to the one-year club. I am 999-1000. Thanks for one year of streams. Do you have ideas for new emotes? I think there are two new emotes I need to update uh, to Twitch, uh, but we're going to probably get rid of some of the other ones. I'm not sure which ones are going to get called. Uh, I think Timmy has uh, the list of ones that aren't used all that much and we'll probably get rid of those um, but I'm thinking that when we go to big games we should probably uh, get some emotes made that are temporary just for that run I think that could be fun like if we do uh, persona 5 again with R then we will uh, we'll use that we'll, ha we'll have some made up for that in advance uh, thank you, Big Bok Choi, for the new sub with Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Big Bok Choi. Welcome to Monkey Tune. Thank you, They Call Me Kevin286 for the 713 sub. Hey, Joe, I love you. I love you too. Love you too, Kevin. Love you too. This line, man, this line. Hope you're doing well, Kevin. Thank you, Lily. Damn, look at the arm go. When's the baby's due date? Uh, sometime in June. Uh, thank you, N7 Krios, for another round of bits. 1,560 bits for 5,110 total. Holy shit, thank you so much, Krios. Uh, I forgot to add this in my last donation, so I'll just say in this one, thank you for making my Saturday bearable at work. Keep up the amazing content. Thank you so much, Krios. That's very generous of you. I uh, hope you like the uh, the next Fallout 76 video. It's a little strange for compared to other stuff on the, on the channel, but I think it'll turn out okay. 
Thank you so much. Wait, where are we going? Uh, we're going back up top now, right? There's a there's a plant boy here. Um, I think I'd rather just go up and, and, and hit that plant boy. There's only one in this room, right? We're one hit from death though, so I need to be careful. Maybe I want to use the shotgun here. I'm cheesing it. I'm cheesing it. Cheesing it meaning running away. Alright, got him, finally. Only took a million bullets, but we did it. I know I should have shot him once around past, but I'm scared that it's gonna... it's He's gonna break out of his, um... His stun, and he's gonna kill me. Okay, how many increments do we have? We have one. Okay, I can't save it. I'm not gonna save it. I wish I had a heal. Uh, let's take the flamethrower. The flamethrower, I think, is going to be more useful against those things. I have quite a bit of mag ammo. Uh, I need to go back and get that stuff, too. Hmm, okay, maybe we'll get some in the greenhouse that helps us in there. It was in this room, wasn't it? This is where the solution, yeah, okay. Senior staff PC, we can use that before, could we? Senior staff yeah, there we go. Oh shit. What the? Fire doesn't work. Fire doesn't work. Fireworks. Oh, that's not a good color. Yeah, get fucked, trees. Oh, this is just going to make him angry, isn't it? That did the trick. Warning. You have dispersed a dangerous solution without authorization. Your actions have been logged. What? And you may be subject to disciplinary measures. No, nah, I'm good. So, is that is that fluid fl Really? You guys are made of plants. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Knife him, Kni no! Oh god damn, that was close. Oh, sh shit. Oh, man, that was close. What? Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, shit. Okay, we're dead. We're dead, we're dead, we're dead, we're dead. Yeah, we're dead. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. I'm pissed. Alright, when did we last save it? It was a while ago, wasn't it? I told you to heal. I didn't have any healing stuff.
I would heal if I could. Should have healed. Should have healed. You, you guys are right. I'm sorry. Should have healed. Um, let's take the the flamethrower. Okay, kind of want to take the knife to take two knives, and we have two get out of jail free cards. Okay, so let's not go the same way that we went last time. We can go to the greenhouse control room and then activate the thing, get the drug, and then go down. Let's do that. Uh, let's let's toast them. I don't. I think if you toast them, they stay dead, don't they? I mean, they should, but it's this game, so who knows? He should die from the fire. Yeah. Okay, is he dead or do you need to roast him even more? Let's see if his pustules come back to life. He still looks pretty alive to me. Come over here, plant boy. Yeah, they're still alive. Okay, now he's dead. All right. So like the note said about make them go black to ash. All right. Okay, and it was this one. Uh this one, this one, this one. Oh, we have to do the puzzle again. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. So is it just like a double tap once they start? Then I beat the witness. Yep, but there's there's nothing more frustrating than doing a puzzle you've already done again. This is a really good puzzle. It's not a bad puzzle, yeah. It's it's pretty good. Alright, he's dead. Okay, and that's it. There are no more around here, right? It was just the three plant boys. I feel like I should be able to burn my way through that. Okay, 
so we put in here. Manual mode engaged. Adjust amount of solution to match cartridge capacity. And we want a one of these plus what's ever left over after it goes all the way into this one, right? So if I remember correctly, I put in here and then this one And then that's it. Okay, let's go over the Helix thing. And I had some more people I should say thank you to. Uh, thank you again for the bits, uh, N7 Krios. Uh, Dax Steer has resubscribe for four months with a message. Thanks for all the streams, Joe. Really liking these short ones. I haven't been able to keep up, but for when I watch the VODs of this, hi me. Oh, hi. Hi, Dax here, being a VOD boy. Shout out to the VOD boys and girls. Thank you very much. Hopefully you didn't skip over the repeated puzzle when we died there. You might, you might miss your message. Sorry about that. Uh, thank you, Ride on my Onyx, for the 15 month resub. Hey, Weeb, it's been a while. It's been a while. Sorry it's been at, if it's been asked a million times already, but are you streaming the newest, hottest Weeb game, Kingdom Hearts 3? Uh, I am not. I don't think we'll ever stream Kingdom Hearts 3, because if I'm going to stream Kingdom Hearts 3, I'm going to stream all of them, and I don't think we're ever going to get to that. But um, I'll never say never outright except for some really rare circumstances, but um, yeah, it's highly unlikely. Uh, I hear that most people are disappointed in it, aren't they? Or it's, it's a lot more mixed. Uh, I don't know if this counts as a spoiler. So if you really care about going into Kingdom Hearts 3 blind, you might want to just cover your ears for the next say 30 seconds just to be safe but uh i heard that okay one two three i'm saying it now i heard that there are no final fantasy characters in it or very few and uh that's really disappointing to me yeah that's all i'll say is that i'm disappointed about that Have you been asked if you're going to play Return to the Oberdin on this stream yet? Nope, not yet. Not on this stream. Nope. Oh, damn. We're just col collecting knives here. The knives work on our, on our big boy uh, Prometheus. I really want it. I really want to save it. I really want to save it, but we're not going to. Uh, thank you, Questioning Turkey, for the 13 month resub. Number 13, Burger King. Wait. <laughs> I love your name, Questioning Turkey. Thank you, thank you very much for the resub. Number 15, Burger King Foot Lettuce. Uh, moon. Moonly? Or Moonelli, I think it's Moonelli. Has to subscribe for two months with seven three zero one one is limping a lot. You're right. He is. Yeah, I'm chronically low on healing supplies. Pretty good for ammo, despite shooting a lot of things that chat doesn't want me to shoot. But yeah, chronically low on healing supplies. On hard, I don't know if you get more on standard or if you just take less damage on standard but on hardcore it seems to be really well uh well um spaced out in terms of mistakes 
All right, will you come to life? Okay, are you gonna come to life while I'm reading the email? Or is that pausing it? Okay, maybe maybe she'll let us. Oh, is it bugged? Oh no. Oh no. Dr. Lingard, remember me? Your old pal Ransom? Hey Joe, why suddenly near Automata is an 8 out of 10 and Persona 5 is only a 7 out of 10? I mean, root B, button mash combat, flare side quest, no proper healing system. Mm. Because numbers are really arbitrary and kind of shit, so uh, Nier Automata is more fun in its gameplay, this even with those problems than, than Persona 5. But if I really weighed out my enjoyment, then Persona 5 might be higher. Cooling, and that's why numbers are flawed. Persona 5 definitely feels like the better made game, but mm, I don't know. Maybe they should both be a seven. Don't, don't, you know, put any importance on the numbers I give out. They're usually just a way of communicating my rough idea of a game. They'll probably change over time too. Like Odyssey is probably more of a five than a six now. And maybe Persona 5 is more of an 8. I don't know. Have you watched the rest of development? Yeah, I've seen, um, I think, all of Season 1, 2, and 3. I haven't seen much of the new ones. I heard they were bad. Every time anyone mentions Mr. X, I think of Mr. F. Mr. F. I think I said that on one of the streams. I think it was the last stream I was saying Mr. F. Mr. F. Alright, um, I really, really want to save it. I think I will. I think we'll get another ink ribbon soon, right? I think I'm risking it. I don't want to have to do this again. If it goes poorly, I'll just blame the stream. The stream is making me do it. Stream put pressure on me to not repeat this content again. Uh, thank you, BTG99, for the three-month resub. Sorry, I'm getting distracted from my list here, and I should really say thank you before uh, before too long. It's rude. Thank you, BTG99, for the three-month resub. Thanks so much. Spiky Shrike, use some bits to say, knock, knock, open up the door, it's real. I love that song. I sing it all the time. <laughs> And most of you probably know about the, the Team Fortress 2 version, right? If you don't, you can Google that right now and have a good time. Open the door, get on the floor, everybody off the dinosaur. That's a good one, too. Oh, you're new. Again. 
Oh, good thing we saved it. Oh, they're all back? Oh no, they're not back. They're just they're just new ones. Okay. Okay, he's not allowed in here. Oh shit, okay. Okay, this time for sure. Oh, uh, okay. Okay, well, th this this one, he's already been in this one. He's already been in this room. What? Let me check my email. William Birkin, subject high priority, increased security. When did Nest become a nest for spies? Oh, three last month and another four this month. And those are just the ones we caught. Stuff up security cart, right? Or do you want to end up like your predecessor? Also, I'll be shifting access to the West area from today. Ignore all requests from headquarters to inf for information on G. Those who contribute nothing to this project anyway. No reply. Auto-generated mail. Warning. Unauthorized access detected. Herbicide dispersal. Okay, that's the one we just did. All right. What about Ada? There's no way Ada's an FBI agent. Okay, can you really not come in this room? Like the Spice Girl said, are you for real? What the fuck? Really? Okay, okay. all right. So, this game has some weird fucking decisions. If he comes into this room right now, that's, that's just absolutely unacceptable. Meanwhile, Prometheus guy, can't go through this door. All right, I know he's in this room. Arr, all right, arr, time to go through the greenhouse control room. Arr, through the greenhouse. Arr, down this fucking ladder. All right, arr, through the lounge. Got my way, dead liquors. Arr, up these fucking stairs. Arr, oh, no, I got it. <laughs> fucking hell. Is he is he really doing that? I think he is. Players would have raged if X entered the safe room. He does in the police station, though. Um, I want to go back and use the uh, the thing on the the nap room and see what we get. Okay, this is the right way. Uh, did we kill all the zombies in here? I can't remember. I guess we're gonna find out. Okay, we toasted him. Toasty. Okay, muff.
Okay, that's it, right? Oh no. Oh, we've been bamboo- Oh, sweet. Fucking hell. Awesome. We've been bamboozled. Wayne Lee's note. Dear God, blood everywhere. What's What the hell's happening? They're dead. All dead. It was those men in black. USS-less headquarters special forces. But why? Isn't their job to protect us? White brains in a sea of red. This can't be happening. Dear God, why? Didn't everybody say I was a genius? A genius like me can't die in a place like this. I always got results. They're screwing me. Well, maybe I'll screw them. I'll win the Nobel. I'm a hero, a genius, a god. I will not die. I will. Itchy tasty. Alright, now would be a bad time for, for Mr. X to just show up. Oh shit, we need level 4 for this one. Alright. Has Joe played Deltarune yet? No, not yet. Uh, thank you, Croxy, for the 2 month resub. Thank you very much. There's no message, so I'll just say thank you. If uh, you wanted to type something out and it wouldn't let you, um, just at me in chat and I'll read out whatever you want. Proxy, but thank you for the resub. Thank you, Eticus, for 60 bits. Non stop pop up stainless steel. It's a great song. It's almost as good as uh, Remix to Ignition, but unfortunately, we can't listen to that anymore. And thank you, CB Turk, for the 25 bits. Itchy Tasty Joe, these inside jokes are ruining chat morale. Feels bad, man. These, that's the Resident Evil jokes, man. Resident Evil. Nest Wrecker. Will I be playing Anthem? Mm, I don't know. Maybe we should. It looks interesting. I think of all the superheroes that Iron Man would make a really great game. So uh, I'm interested in giving it a try. But it's just sort of bland, you know? If they went more with the Iron Man thing and they had like energy hand cannons and shit, instead of just like, hey, I have an assault rifle, it's kind of just eh. But yeah, it does look interesting. Maybe we'll play it for a stream or two. I don't know. We'll see. OSS. All right, that just brought the lights back on. Okay, there's something in here. Oh, no, it's on the G virus. 1998, wow, this has been here for a long time. work. I'm not handing over anything. We have our orders, Dr. Birkin. I'll ask you one more time. Hold your fire! I 
hope he's okay. What the fuck were you thinking? Our orders were to bring him in alive. We're in, sir. But we had a snafu. Target resisted. We had to take him out. That's correct, sir. Roger that. Move. So those were G samples. Is a real G? Jane Doyle suspending research on G. The Umbrella Corporation has decided to cease all research on G, which was ongoing at the Nest Underground Laboratory. All funding for this project has been cut, and Laboratory Director William Birkin has been removed from his post. Sender B.E., subject none, thank you for your mail, Dr. Birkin. Top Brass has expressed an interest in this evolving bioweapon you mentioned. Do not worry about, the, about costs. Our company is the most well-funded in the whole of the United States. Oh, damn. Sender Richard Kessler, subject, congratulations. I heard the good news. G. Congratulations is almost ready. Strange you never thought to report to the never thought to report to the research lab here at Umbrella HQ, but I suppose I can let that slide. Anyway, send over the data, will you would you? And don't worry, you've done good work on G. We can take care of the rest. Jane Doyle, notice of admonishment. You are under suspicion of breaching your contract with the Umbrella Corporation. It has become clear that you have claimed ownership of the G project and have been in, in in unauthorized contact with the U.S. military, please respond to the investigation committee summons within 24 hours. Oh no, Birkin, what did you do? Oh no. All right, um, this can just get stored. Fuck it. Um, we want to keep this. Uh, we have a lot of space now. All of a sudden, let's take a blue herb just in case. Let's take some more handgun ammo, and let's take the flamethrower. Um, no, let's not take a blue herb. Let's take the flamethrower. Just in case there are more plant boys. I don't think they're going to be, though. Okay, there's something else in here. Is there a... Um, is there an ink ribbon in here? Is there even a typewriter in here? No. Alright, what did we miss? There's a plant. Oh, it's a blue. All right, maybe we need the blue for something. Nothing in here. Oh, I remember this one from the movie. We're about to get turned into cubes. Okay, this feels very bossy, and I haven't been able to save it. And I'm really injured, so I don't know how this is gonna go. Damn, you ever notice how the Umbrella Corporation symbol kinda looks like you're looking at an umbrella from a bird's eye view? Fuck, that should, that should go in the video. That's a really good observation. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, this is this is this this is the th shit. <laughs> no, we should have explored the rest of the room. No! <laughs> yeah! The fucking ink ribbon! <laughs> Alright, um... So let's, let's store that. Gunpowder. With high grade. Let's mix them both together for some more shotgun shells. Okay, there we go. Uh, we'll keep the flamethrower and the, uh, the thing. I kind of feel like this, this might be the last boss, maybe? 
Wow, no heal. Holy shit. Hardcore. Hardcore. All right. Um. Let's see what happens. We'll we'll keep the we'll keep the uh the mag Maggie uh in her box for now. Let's see what happens. Bring that damn, damn red herb. Yeah, we might run into a green herb on the way, right? I'm guessing we're gonna fall into the into the reactor room down there. Yeah, let's let's bring the red herb. We might need it. Interesting point to note, the soldier who spoke in the video, known as Hunk, is played by the same voice actor who does Shido's voice in Persona 5. Oh, does he really? When are you going to stream the game on Hardcore in those days? Probably never. Research diary. Embryo growth observation, subject 449. After the G embryo is implanted in the subject, we made a 50 centimeters incision from the chest to the abdomen and began our observations. Holy shit. Uh, with the help of the medical team, the subject's consciousness level was kept between 15 lucid GCS 10. However, the subject's consciousness level deteriorated and further observation was deemed unnecessary. The subject was then disposed of. Breeding rate observation, subject 501, the G-virus was administered to subject 501, 501 mutated into G-form and was introduced to a group of 30 test subjects. After two hours, 36 minutes, it was observed that all but one of the test subjects had been implanted with an embryo. All subjects were disposed of. One subject broke down during experimentation and took their own life. T-virus resistance experimentation, subject 628639. We administered the G-virus to subject 628, who had shown slight resistance to the T-virus. The virus was then introduced to subject 639 with whom 628 had a close relationship. 628 showed some signs of resistance, but had been implanted with an embryo after 24 minutes. T-virus resistance does nothing, to, does nothing to stop the mental deterioration caused by the G-virus. Damn. G will beat T. Should have mixed the red with the blue. Yeah, you're probably right. I should have. Mr. F. Oh, no. It's, um... It's Eyeball Dude. It's Birkin with the Gherkin. start. G-Virus, but we never intended this spin it any way you want. You're still responsible. Shit, I hope she's okay. Oh, you just made him stronger. Oh, she is okay. Oh, 
Oh, now you can vault over things? It's gonna be a long boss battle, boys and girls. Gonna be a long boss battle. Strap in. Okay, let's take the mag. Uh, let's leave the flamethrower. I don't think the flamethrower is gonna be very effective against him. Maybe I'm wrong, but I don't think so. Um, let's take the Magnum. Take the grenade. Um, and we have one empty slot here. Okay. Okay, I'm, I'm guessing that the Magnum's gonna, you know, do a lot of damage, but hopefully, hopefully, we'll see. Flashbangs will say really this this is a no flashbang run. Okay, do I have to hit the eyes? Oh, and we're dead. <laughs> hit or miss. Okay, maybe I can dodge past them and see if I can find a green herb in the area. There's got to be a heal somewhere in the area. There's got to be. Thought for sure I'd gotten him with the with the magnum shot there, but no. Uh, thank you, Papa John's napkins, for the former three sub. How is this game, Cap of Pride? It's pretty good. It's pretty good. I'm having a good time. Thank you, Papa John's napkins. Right, I'm running past him. Yeah. That's not a herb. And we're dead. Not a herb. All right, so there's some bullets on there, so that way's not the right way. I'm having fun. I'm having a, uh, I'm having sans flashbacks. The music's really good. I wish I could hear it for more than five fucking seconds. Why are you starting this battle already heavily injured? Oh, you're, I should heal. Fuck, you're right. I should heal, fuck. Alright, I'm gonna go over here. I'm guessing this way. I guess poorly. Okay, that looked like it hit its eye. I guess it, it just did a big blood squirt next to its eye? Must have missed. <sighs> if it hits the eye, it'll be orange. Wasn't that orange? Or was that a pale yellow? Big eye, big health. But this is the big Maggie, man. All right, fourth try. It's fourth time's the charm. Maybe it's directly opposite. There's a herb over here. That's flamethrower fuel. No, that time I missed, and I missed that time. Yeah, definitely. All right, I'm missing. I'm not hitting the eye. All right, is there a plant over here? There's no plant. There's no plant. Okay, we don't we don't need the fuel. Do, 
do 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 Oh, this one is back. Okay. This one is back. Uh, sorry, I, I keep forgetting to take my healing out of the box before I go in. I'm sorry. Ne next time I'll heal for sure. Sorry. <sighs> oh, for f that time? Come on. Yeah, we got him. We have we have not got him. We have n gentlemen, we have not got him. Oh, that's a bad move. Knife him. Yeah. What's that? Is that a heal? No. <sighs> Unauthorized removal. Unauthorized removal. Unauthorized removal. Unauthorized removal. I wonder if I had thrown a grenade at him. I wonder if. Oh shit, I forgot to heal again. Fuck. Okay, next time, next time for sure. Next time for sure. No games this week. Couldn't get the Elgato to work. Next time for sure. I wonder if I thrown the grenade at him. I wonder if that would just blow up all of his eyes. Okay, we're dead. Oh, we're not dead yet. One of these has to be a heal. Handgun bullets. Yes, what we exactly what we needed in this situation. Oh, he he did a he did a sneaky attack. He did a sneaky attack. At this point, I just want to do it without healing. I think I can do it. Okay, am I forgetting something? No, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Oh, the healing! Uh, I, I'm already at the- I'm closer to the door now. I'm closer to the door than I was to the box. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah, getting better.
Oh no, we died. Alright, that didn't even look like it hit me, actually. Shockwaves, he's he's part Taurus demon, you're right. <sighs> Doctor Lingard. Really? I, I what? Ah, I guess it's hitting the area right around his eye sometimes. Okay, I don't know why I keep combining these er these herbs because I don't think there's a green herb down there. I think we would have found it by now. Why does Leon move like a sloth? Because uh, he's injured. He moves pretty slow even when he's not injured, but yeah. Okay, that time, come on. That time, surely. I'm starting to suspect some shenanigans going on here. It takes two, it doesn't take two. I've hit it. I've hit it in one. Maybe it needs to be right in the center of his eye for it to take one. You have to. You don't have to hit it twice. I hit it once earlier. I've shot it once and it's exploded like. At least three times. There we go. All right, we're dead. Is it here? Here? No. Oh, mad gamma. Nice. That's what. That's the gun we're using. Fucking really? Really? Oh shit, what's he doing? Oh, that's not, that's not cool. I'm sorry, did, did, did Leon just counter that throw by throwing a fucking grenade at it? Did... <laughs> We're dead. <laughs> did, he, did he just counter the fucking thing being thrown with a fucking flashbang? <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> oh, fuck, man. All right, well, that went better. That went better. Um, maybe we should get the Gunstock Matilda. Yeah, let's do that. Let's take that. All right, um, should we take some flash grenades and use it on him? I don't know. I don't know. I feel like we're doing okay. I mean, we've only died like twice, so I think we're doing okay. Yeah, I think we're doing okay. Yeah, let's just leave it. What, I have six flashbangs? Because they're shit, man. No one, no one uses them. They're so bad I haven't even tried them. That was fast. Okay, so I think it's that if you uh, if you wait for the crosshairs to go all the way focus, that you will get the extra damage, and that's what's doing with the eye. I thought that last time, so I think that's why sometimes it takes two hits. All right, uh, where's the gunstock Matilda? Flashbangs are actually really useful against guy. Yeah, they probably are, because um, he has so many eyes and will blind him, and then you can probably line up a hit real quick on him. It's not extra damage, it's just that the bullet doesn't pull to the side. I'm, I'm pretty sure that that was right on, and, it's, and it, didn't, it didn't push it. I'm pretty sure it is extra damage. Did I get the eye there? I did, oh nice. Oh no I didn't, now I got it. Okay, while he's doing that, let's see if we can find a heal. Was here all along, first aid Chen. Do we use it, chat? Chat, do we use it? I don't know if we use it or not. Let's let's decide. Do we use it? I don't know, do we use it? Oh, we could have just found it on the map all this time. Why didn't you guys tell me that? What the fuck? What's wrong with you? Why didn't you guys tell me that? Alright, we're using it.
Oh, we didn't even need the heal. We didn't even get hit. Didn't even get hit. Didn't even need first aid, Chan. In case you just uh, tuned in, by the way, uh, that was first try. First try. Easy game, easy life. Did we get everything? No, we're seeing a grenade and some fuel over there. Leon right now is like, huh, she makes some good points, but at the same time, Ada's pretty hot and she kissed me. Uh, Alright, why can't I shoot her? Hmm. Okay. That upon wants to save. Self-destruct sequence. Datapon wants to save. More than anything else, Datapon wants to save. Alright, do we even want the Magnum? We have two bolts in the Magnum. That's, pro that's probably actually pretty good. Alright. You have ink ribbons? No, I have no ink ribbons. That's what I'm saying, I, I want to save. Oh, it's FBI legs. Agent legs. What? You could bypass those this whole time? I was just thinking about you. That makes two of us. I was getting worried. You know, we make a good team. I gotta ask you something. Way's clear. Please, tell me you got it. Oh, I got it. <laughs> Place is literally crumbling around us, Leon. I ran into Annette. She claims you're not FBI. Oh, Leon. Why couldn't you just hand over the sample? Ada, you could have just said, no, I totally am FBI, and he would have believed- Wouldn't you just let him draw his gun? I really hoped it wouldn't end up like this. So that's all this was. I was 
just some pawn to you? Look, I'm just doing my job. And I'm doing mine, so drop that damn gun! I'm taking you in. Hand over the sample, Leon. I don't want to hurt you. And you shoot me. But I don't think you can. Oh, please shoot him. Please. Wait, what? We're going down? Why are we going down? No, this is the, this is the opposite of where we want to go. We don't want to go down. Oh no. down here oh nice suit first aid spray chan Get out. Fast. <laughs> we can make it. Where are you now? Claire, are you still there? <laughs> hey, Leon, you're breaking up. Forget about me. Just get out of here. Damn it. Okay. Uh, what's in here? Sorry, it's it's not that bad. I'm just I'm just really easily amused when it comes to stuff like this. It's not that bad. All right, we have a combat knife. We don't have room for it though. Um, I don't know. Should should we drop one some of our like over what what do we two hundred bullets here close to it? Nah. Nah, we we don't need another knife. Alright, get rid of these useless flashbangs. Alright, time's short. Let's go back and get that knife. Do, do, 
do 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 Damn. So knife is is edge chan, right? And first aid spray is undo chan, because you're like undoing a mistake. Damn, they live on. They transcend the games. Oh shit, it's one of these guys. Okay, anything down here? Oh, we missed a blue herb. Oh well. Oh, green herb. Oh shit. Shit, I really want the green herb. Um. Uh. Get uh, the, the magnum. The ma yeah, we don't need. The, let's get rid of a knife. Inventory is full. Ah oh, shit. Is there someone needs a grenade here? No. Let's just get rid of the knife. Let's combine it with another knife. Music man. What's here? Oh, more more handgun ammo. That's what we need. Okay, why is it gearing us up for? Ah, oh, yeah, here we go. All right, um, all right. His weakness. A corridor that I can lead him down. Yeah, we did it. Oh, it's the game is testing us. And then the door's locked. No, it's okay. Run past the enemies instead of shooting them. The whole game has been training for this moment. Just jump through the fire. Jump through the fire. Okay, if we kill Mr. X in combat here, the game loses a whole point. Of my arbitrary scale. Uh, gotta keep going. When did he lose his hat? The, the the moment we met him, he lost his hat. I shot it off. Yes, more hanging out. Nice. The fuck is that? Joint plug. Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright, what are we what are we getting rid of? We only have two magnum shots. Let's get rid of that. Joint butt plug? Damn. Well Valentine's Day is coming. Here, here he comes. Did he say what the hell? I didn't hear the what the hell. Oh, he's super powered up. Looks like we're losing a point, boys. Isn't this Armstrong from, from Revengeance? Oh 
shit. Oh, did that get- was that a hit or was that just a stun? I have a knife. Oh, we're just dead. Okay. <laughs> Wait, first, first aid spray. First aid spray. Okay, so wasn't wasn't fast enough moving to the right. Ah, we we're doing we we're doing so well too. We were doing so well. All right, we only have two. We only have two magnum shots. So let's get rid of it. Avoidable. I should. I should fucking hope so. It's a. It's an insta kill. Really? Good thing we got the extra knife. Okay, do you want to keep the one bullet? I don't think we do. Like the one the one uh, shotgun shell? I don't think we do. Okay, so what do I have to do? Was I not far enough to the right or what? Do I have to shoot him in the head as he's charging at me? Oh, we got tagged immediately. All right, that's not good. Aw, oh, that was lame. Damn, I don't know what I did to piss Drax off, but you know. Oh, there we go. All right, so we, we stunned him with a hit to the heart. this again. That sucked. Alright, let's use uh, first aid spray chan. Alright, that seems like a shockwave stun thing. That wasn't damage. That was damage. Oh, wow, that hurt.
Okay, is it over or? Of course. Oh, we're at the bottom level, all right. Oh man, I hope he's okay. Shit, should I just run past there? Claire driving the train. Can't believe I actually miss her. Well, that was a video game. Well, the frames for a moment there, yeah, it dropped. That was the game, it was in the stream. It dropped real bad. Cause we're gonna shout it loud, even if our words seem meaningless. Hey Joe, what don't you like that much about this game so far? Uh, the combat. I don't like the combat. I can't believe I had so many bullets at the end. What's that all about? All right, we did a chat. We beat it on hardcore first time through. It wasn't so bad. It wasn't so bad. How the fuck you got so many bullets? You just not killing anything? According to chat, I was killing too many things. So maybe they just. Pile them on right at the end.
Do you know what the next game is going to be? Not yet. I don't know if we're going to play Portal 1 and Portal 2 or if we're going to play something else. Vampire, the, the, the Vast Grade, Bloodlines or whatever. I don't know what we're going to do first. We should probably knock out Portal 1 and 2. Fun fact, if you just wait dodge long enough in the Tyrant fight, it gives you the launcher and you went, yeah, that's, that seems about right. What would hurt more, getting hit by a rocket launcher or getting slammed into a wall with a SWAT truck? It seems like the rocket launcher should be the bit, the, the more damaging choice there, but I'm not sure. You will die instantly with the rocket. You're dying instantly no matter what. You're not surviving either of those two. The truck didn't have that much space to accelerate. I don't know, it was going pretty fast. It was enough damage to go through a concrete wall, and then it exploded. Have you played Fallout New Vegas port? Yep, many times. I haven't finished all the DLC though. Final thoughts on Resident Evil 2? Uh, I haven't finished it yet, so it's not final thoughts. Those you have to play the whole game as Claire again, right? Ever play the Mass Effect trilogy? I played one and two, and I liked them quite a lot. This music's great. Uh, there are a bunch of people I need to say thank you to that um, I haven't looked at my list since the the boss, William. Sorry about that. I'll, I'll get to that once the credits are done. I don't want to all tab out just in case it skips something. I think I get ranked, don't I? I'm probably going to get like a C rank. Maybe worse. Have you thought more about playing Return of the Oberdin on stream? There we go. There it is. There it is. Someone asked now. Yeah, we'll probably do it. I'll probably turn chat off so I don't get spoiled. Why would a fight with Mr. X at the end be a bad thing? Wouldn't leave leaving without killing be worse? The reason why it's a bad thing, IMO, is because you can't kill him the whole game with your weapons. And then at the end, suddenly it's like, oh, now you can't kill him. Um, it justifies it a little bit that you have to use this anti-tank weapon that Ada throws at you. I don't know if you can kill him without using that, but um, that saves it a little bit. But at the same time, unless it's a, another Prometheus guy, I feel like if, if the tank weapon killed him, then the SWAT van blowing up should have killed him too. Which do you like better, Resident Evil 7 or Resident Evil 2 and why? Mm, I think I might have liked this better than Resident Evil 7. This was more fun and had more varied environments. Not sure though. He was also damaged from a previous explosion. You could even count the van explosion into it. All adds up. Well, that's just kind of supporting my problem though, is that if damage adds up over time with all of the bullets and magnum shots and shotgun shells that I can collect over the entire game, I should be able to kill him. Grenades too, right? I know, it seems kind of arbitrary, but the using the anti-tank weapon saves it a little bit. It's not as big of a problem as I said before we did the fight. Oh no, what was that? Leon S. Kennedy, game mode hardcore, total time, 9 hours, 55 minutes, saves 27, C rank. C's pretty good, I'll take C. I'll take a C rank. 
So I think you, if you want to get an S rank, you need to only save it three times. I think I've seen that on Twitter. Costume alternative. Here emerges game mode, Claire second story mode, costume, Leon, normal, custom, model, quick draw, army, bring marshmallows. New game second run has been unlocked, selected under story from the main menu. The ending and certain parts of the game are different in the second run scenarios. What's the online store? No, I'm good actually. I don't want to look at that. Oh, good old Marvin. Marvin was the best character. Fucking Trevor. I mean, what happened between this and... Like, why did an explosion make him go super tyrant? It's actually, isn't that something that happens in Resident Evil 6 as well? When they take, uh, not Resident Evil 6, I haven't played Resident Evil 6. Resident Evil 5, when they take damage, they, they regenerate stronger or something. Maybe that's a thing. Did I like Neo? I love Neo. Neo is fantastic. Okay, so new game, second run, results, costumes... Oh, we don't have um, more for her because we haven't done that run yet. Anyway, uh, sorry to do this so late, but thank you T Just TT for the 16 month resub with the message. How are you doing, Joe? Have not been able to watch much live, but I'm really digging the VODs. Thanks for all the amazing content. You're very welcome, T Just TT. Thank you for the resub and the message. Uh, sorry it took me so long to read it out. Uh, but if you're watching on the VOD, then um, I guess it's okay. I got into the boss battle. But we killed it first try. It's okay. Thank you. Uh, Technician Tim has resubscribed for 10 months. Still looking forward to more FTL. Me too, actually. I'd like to get back into FTL. FTL was fun. I'd like to, uh, to beat it. I think we got close, right? With our janky run that we did. It was fun. Uh, thank you, Stain Porcelain, for the 15-month resub. No message, so I'll just comment again about how much I like your name. Thank you, Stain Porcelain. That was an hour ago too. Sorry, uh, T just TT technician Tim and Stain Porcelain. Also to Tundra Tenrec for the twelve month resub. Welcome to the one year club, Tundra Tenrec. Joseph, thanks to you, Lily, Leo, and Finn for a year of laughs, cringes, not all chats, and embarrassing weeb shit. Here's to another year. God bless and shout out to the VOD boys and gals from my wife and I. Oh, that's a nice message. Thank you so much. That was just straight up wholesome. That was really nice to read. Thank you, Tundra. That was really nice. Uh, thank you, Sarah, Saren. I always say this name wrong. Sarah N for the sub with Prime. Thank you very much. Uh, it says this is a new sub, but I'm pretty sure I've said your name before unless someone has a name very similar to yours, but thank you very much. Welcome to Prime Time. 
<laughs> the next person is the cat butt. Thank you very much, the cat butt. Welcome to Prime Time. Welcome to Monkey Town. Cool name. Uh, thank you, Sovereign Snake, for the 16 month resub. Any plans to go on a podcast in the near future? Keep up the dank memes. Um, not really at the moment. It's very, very difficult for me to get time to, um, to speak into a microphone without there being a lot of noise in the background. And I can tolerate some of the stuff when it's my own stream, but if I was to go on someone else's podcast or something, I would be very self-conscious about uh, any noise or any interruptions that might happen. So uh, it's very difficult at the moment. So that might not happen until we're back in the basement when it gets warmer in a couple months. But I'd like to do it more. I'd like to have my own podcast at some point. I think that would be fun to do. Uh, but I need to get, I need to meet someone named Jamie to uh, pull up all this stuff for me. So, I don't know. Are any of you named Jamie? Uh, thank you, Ralph Cogs, for the 10 bits to say he get mad when he loses his hat. So he's very mad because he lost his bulletproof shirt. That's true. That's true. As he gets uh, more naked, he becomes more angry and mutates more. Uh, thank you, Nef Dimension Tripper, for the 200 bits. We did it. Leon A. Complete. Yena. Yeafications. Uh, Claire Side. Ho. Yeah, we'll probably do Claire Side, I think. We're not done yet, right? There's still more here. Uh, how long have we been up for, though? Uptime is uh, 2 hours and 15 minutes. So it's probably a good time to stop before we get into another run. Uh, but I think I want to do the rest of it. I don't know. What do you guys want to do? do? Should I move on to another game or should I should I do the Clara run? I don't want to be like IGN and I've only played half the game. Although I do have to say, I can't really blame him all that much. That did feel like a complete experience. Yeah, 85% of a complete experience. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, it depends. You think they get some information. Yeah, I think we should do Claire B. So what do we, what do we do? We do new run. And then we do Claire. Okay, so this isn't gonna show up until, the one for Leon isn't gonna show up until we do Claire on new game. So I'm guessing that depending on the route, Leon gets to places before Claire does, Claire gets to places before Leon does in the other one. Do it on standard so we can speed through. Hey Joe, how's Catherine? Catherine is pretty good. I, maybe we should do it on standard so I can see if I can kill all the zombies and see what the difference is. It will also unlock that after Claire B. Catherine was pretty good. I really enjoyed it. Yeah, I get that too. But if you still, but still, if you review something, you should kind of do two playthroughs or at least see what the game has to offer extra. Uh, it's really not standard practice to do two playthroughs to review something. Um, uh, myself and some other YouTubers that play games multiple times before we do videos on them are the exception, not the rule. It's really not, it's really not standard. But honestly, as, as sad as this is, a lot of reviewers don't even finish the game once, never mind doing two playthroughs. I agree with you, but it's, it's, there's no precedent for it. Since you already know the solution to main puzzles, you can also speed run some moments. Oh, some of the puzzles are the same? I guess we'll, we'll see how that goes. Claire B now, it's the intended way to play A, B, and then B, A. Don't play two A, A, one after another. Yeah, so if I do one, if if this, if this I do Claire right now, that's Claire A, right? Okay. All right, so we'll start this next, next stream, which should be tomorrow, but again, I can't promise that it's going to be this stream every day. I try, but sometimes it doesn't happen. Um, I'm hoping there's going to be a, a video tomorrow, but uh, even if I get all the audio recording done uh, tonight, um, audio editing and putting it up, mm, it might be the next day. We'll see. But I'm hoping. It all it depends on how, how recording goes. The wind's kind of settled a little bit right now, but it's not all the way down. Still going to play on hardcore? I don't know. I think we might go on standard just to feel the difference. I'm interested to see how it feels on, on normal, but um, I could do another run with Claire first, then Leon B, and do that on standard to see, but yeah. Is 
It's Leon and Claire, then fourth survivor, then tofu mode. Oh, it's tofu mode in this one. I remember tofu from from Resident on the PlayStation, right? Or was that was that ne Nemesis? I can't remember which one had tofu. CRE used 100 bits to say better do tofu after Claire. Okay, maybe it is this one. Yeah, maybe it is uh, the second game that had uh, tofu. <laughs> Thank you for the bit, CRE. Okay then, uh, thank you for stopping by everybody. Um, I'm surprised that there were so many people here today after we skipped so many streams. So thank you very much for watching me play Resident Evil 2. I had a good time. I didn't have a great time, but I had a good time. Uh, please don't take that as like overly negative or anything. I think this is, this is a good game. I would recommend it to people, um, but I am not in love with it like so many others are, but it was a good time. I had more f fun playing this than, than Odyssey, for example. Um, just to put it into perspective. I shouldn't use Odyssey. It sounds like I'm picking on it when I'm really not. But yeah. Anyway, so hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. And uh, we'll start the Claire run. Claire B. Um, and I will try to make sure that I don't miss it. But um, there might be a video tomorrow. And if there's a video tomorrow, I might be exhausted. And I think that long video is probably preferable to a stream, but we'll see. Next game, Titanfall 2 story. We did that already. We streamed that. It was a good stream. I had a lot of fun playing Titanfall 2. It was great. See you guys later. You're done. You're done. You're done.